Hello, boys and girls, moms and dads, grandmas, grandpas, cats and dogs, and all you peanut butter sandwiches out there. Paul here for Steam Squad, and today we're going to be looking at a way to read and write secret messages. People have been using secret messages for thousands of years and for lots of different reasons. Maybe you have a great invention that you want to share with your friend but you don't want anyone to steal it. Maybe you're writing a secret message to another pirate to tell them where you buried the treasure. Arr. Or maybe you just want to tell someone something private and you don't want other people to read it. Today, we use secret codes a lot when we are using computers. Every time you log into a game, or to your school's website, there will be a box to enter a password. Your password is encrypted when it is sent. Encrypting is how we change words into a code that no one else can read. Before you can read a secret code message, you need to decrypt it using a key. Decrypting is how we change a secret message back into normal words which everyone can read. One of the oldest types of secret code is called the Caesar cipher. The Caesar cipher swaps out different letters on the alphabet. Today, we will make a code wheel that is able to encrypt and decrypt Caesar cipher messages. To build the Caesar cipher wheel, First, download the PDF file, which you can find linked in the description. Once you have the file, print it out. Cut out the three circles very carefully using a scissors. If you are not comfortable using a scissors, ask an adult to help you. On the smallest circle, you will find a small notch to cut out. This is going to show us what key we are using. Next, use a pencil to poke a small hole in the center of the three circles. Take care to find the center of the circles. If you are slightly off, your wheel might not work. Once you have cut out the three circles and made a hole in the center, next we can use a butterfly clip to hold them together. Now that you have made your code wheel, it is time to learn how to use it. First, let's look at decrypting a message. Look at the secret message. Are you able to read it? Of course not. Neither can I. It is an encrypted message. I know that it uses a Caesar cipher and a key of three. That means I can decrypt it using my code wheel. First, I turn my smallest circle till I am able to see the number three. Next, I hold the smallest circle and the middle circle and turn them both until my key is directly under the letter A. Now my code wheel is ready to decrypt. I can see that the letter L is decrypted to the letter I. F 
will become the letter C. I keep going until I have decrypted the entire message. Now, I can see that the code reads. I can read the code. Awesome! We just decrypted our first message. But what about encrypting? To encrypt our very own secret message, first of all, think what you want to write. I am going to encrypt the secret message. Thank you for watching this video. Think about the key you want to use and move your smallest wheel until you can see that number. I am going to use the key 7 because 7 is my favorite number. Now, once again, move the smallest and the middle wheel until the key is directly under the letter A. It's time to encrypt. Now, I'm looking on the outside wheel for the letters I want and writing the letters that I can see on the middle wheel. I can see that the letter T will become A, H will become the letter O, and A will become H. I keep going until I have encrypted the whole message. It looks like this. Great! No one will be able to read this message. That's it for our Caesar Cipher Code Wheel video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit the video with a like and subscribe to get more fun activities. Till next time, bye bye!